Good afternoon, everybody. It's Friday, September the 11th. Today is the 19th anniversary of 9-11 already. Next year, it'll be 20 years. Uh, just want to take a moment to remember all those affected by that day. And, uh, you know, you never forget something like that. So, uh, just again, remembering everyone affected by that horrible, horrible day. But we are headed out to a little, to just to do a little quick gas and go. <laughs> uh, gas and goes always get a, uh, a good rise out of people. But this one is getting changed out Monday morning. The reason we're gonna go do a little gas and go is because I tried to schedule it for today, but I just didn't have time to change it out today. Uh, I, I'm, I'm too busy and I'm working by myself. So uh, luckily this man understands and this is one of his rental properties that we're going to. And it's, it's just not cooling well. Um, I went the other day and he, he was like, you know, it's got leaks and he's like, well, no, don't put no Freon in it. You know, let's just change it out. He said, I just, I've already, he's already, he's got two other ones there on the property. They're mobile homes. And he's done, replaced both of those systems. Not with me. This was before he found me. Um, because it, I was supposed to do the job yesterday, which was Thursday, but I called him in the morning, you know, and told him so I, there was no way. And then again today, I, you know, I was like, man, I'm sorry. I just, I can't. Uh, the, my guy that helps me is, uh, he's out of town for a wedding right now. So not that I can't do the job by myself to change out. It just, it would take me much longer. And then these other customers that have no air would get put on the back burner and they'd probably end up calling somebody else anyway. You know, y'all know how that goes. And uh, I said, I tell you what, man, I said, look, I, I called him this morning. And I said, look, I can't do it today. I said, but I, I could definitely do it Monday. I said, but I'm going to go out there and I'm going to gas her up to keep her cool over the weekend so she doesn't bother him and it makes everybody happy. Um, and he was fine with that. So, you know, I'm not going to charge him to do this. If it buys me the weekend, then that's fine. Again, it's just, there's just been too much work for me to get this job done. But now, it's not like the lady's completely out of air. That would be a different story. But if she just needs a little gas, I'll gladly gas her up. Keep her cool over the weekend and we'll knock this job out Monday. So we'll, uh, we'll just we'll take a little look at a little gas and go here here in a few minutes, guys. All right, so here we have a York Luxair Guardian Fcon product. Uh, micro channels leaking. We'll have to, I like to cement blocks because, you know, Lafayette, we get a hard rain out here in the country, it floods. But that's a 30 by 30 pad. We're gonna have to get a 30, I'm sorry, a 40 by 40 for the ring because the ring is so big. And uh, I'm not, this is not scientific. This thing had lock caps on it. It's not scientific. I'm not worried about checking head pressure, super heat, none of that. Uh, it's a 410A unit. The micro channel leaks, so does the evaporator. They have it uh, anchored down with a uh, mobile home anchors which they did that for the hurricane i'm sure which will work i mean that son of a bitch is not moving but um so you guys can call me what you want about the way i'm, ch I'm charging this unit but all this has got to do is last till monday so this is a jug of 410a believe it or not the uh i don't know how it is in y'all's area but all jugs are going to this color they said r22 410 everything if you look right here it is 410A, and I even wrote it here with a marker and back here with a marker so I don't lose track. But, uh, yeah, all all the jugs are going to this uh, cream, tan, uh, white, whitish color. So, bleed that. 
It doesn't look extremely low, but she said it's not cooling well, so we'll throw a little gas in there to keep her cool till the weekend. Again, this is not scientific. I'm not looking for it to be scientific. I'm just trying to keep her cool till Monday. So you can uh, nitpick this method all you want. Oh, you're not checking head pressure, superheat, all subcooling. Guys, I'm very, very much aware of that. Again, just has to last her through the weekend. So that'll probably just about do it right there. Okay, well, it's gassed up. Pulling good heat, head pressure's a little high. I did go ahead and put the head pressure thing on there. The head, the thing, I sound like Joe Biden. I did go ahead and put the head pressure hose on and uh, to watch the head pressure because the head pressure can get out of control on these micro channels very, very quickly. So I made sure that didn't happen and uh, she's gassed up. So knocked on the door, she said she does, feels like it's blowing cold colder to her and if that's fine with me if, if it'll keep her happy through the weekend all right guys thanks for watching and until the next one we'll see you on the next one